Good morning. Uh, once again, it is George and Jess, and it's time for Achieving Dreams with our fine friends at Profinium. We've had a, an awesome time doing this so far this holiday season with our sister stations here at Alpha Media Mankato, and it's our turn again, and uh, we have a fantastic nomination this morning. Yeah, we're joined by Taylor Grace from Profinium, and Achieving Dreams is something that you guys have been doing for a few years, and we've been uh, so honored to be able to help you guys out this year with uh, spreading the word and, and getting people involved. So uh, real quick, why don't you tell people what Achieving Dreams is if they are not familiar yet? Yeah, so Achieving Dreams is this fabulous program that Profinium has started to kind of help out our community and really be out there and be in touch with the people that we touch their lives that we interact at interact with anyways so achieving dreams is something that we do to we get nominations in from the community for people in need and extenuating circumstances over the holidays and then we go and try and help them the best we can and this year we got over 200 nominations which is crazy so yeah it's been fun and you guys have been uh, achieving dreams throughout the holiday season and uh, today we are going to make a dream come true for someone and this is the nomination this is what she writes. Her name is Rosalie, and we're going to talk to her in just a couple minutes, but here's what she says. Uh, I was diagnosed with lupus and some other uh, health issues in 2015, and our world stood still. My husband had to step up and be my full-time caregiver. He works full-time, plus he takes me to all my appointments, which is a full plate. Chad is very loving and a wonderful husband. I was recently diagnosed with some more health issues. He is the best husband I could have ever prayed for. He's so stressed due to my health conditions, and no husband should have to go through what he's going through. He would give his last dollar off or the shirt off his back, even though we're struggling. With all he does, taking me to my medical appointments and consults at Mayo and Rochester, he's a hero in my eyes. Some people would have left by now, but he's still there loving me unconditionally. I feel the life-changing impact for Chad would be a washer and dryer to be able to have clean clothes for work. We don't have one. He washes our clothes in the bathtub, so we have clean clothes and dries our clothes on the radiator. It kind of puts things in perspective, it really doesn't does. it? Right? That's something that a lot of us just take for granted. And I don't think that's a lot to ask for. Yeah, so it we isn't. have uh, a big surprise for Rosalie and Chad and some great partners in the community who are helping make this happen with Profinium. And we're going to get Rosalie on the phone. Let's get Rosalie. Let's go to the phone lines. Hello. Hi, is this Rosalie? Yes, it is. Hi, Rosalie. This is George and Jess from Country 103.5 with Taylor Grace from Profinium. How are you this morning? Good. How are you? We're good. Thanks for taking some time for us. We're going to chat with you for a couple minutes, and then we're going to get your husband chat on the phone, okay? All right. Sounds good. So you submitted uh, a lovely nomination for your husband, Chad, for the Achieving Dreams Together program. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about him? Um, we, this uh, August will be married for um, 18 years and I've been together for 20. He's my rock. Um, he's the kind of person that's shy, kind of like keeps to himself, but has no problem giving his last dollar away, giving the shirt off his back if you see somebody in need, but really doesn't ask for help himself and everything. And um, I was diagnosed with lupus. Um, SLE, which is um, basically the worst kind of lupus you can have, and um, I, he was starting to put me through um, uh, college, you know, um, for my bachelor's degree, and I just have been getting sicker and sicker, and so I had a um, withdrawal, um, medically withdrawal from college at Concordia and St. Paul, and um He's basically my main caretaker, and I'm just getting sicker. And he works, you know, full-time, tries to get as many hours as he can. He works nights, and then he barely gets any sleep, and he's, you know, he gets off between midnight and 2 o'clock in the morning, and then he, you know, and then all of a sudden he has to turn around and drive me to Rochester for my appointments and everything. So um, I didn't know a better way to try and thank him for all that he's done especially you know since 2015 and everything and basically you know I'm at that point where I'm not quite in uh, renal failure but there is a possibility because uh, my body's rejected most of the medications and the doctors basically said there's nothing more we can do so he you know he's trying his best and he's such a good-hearted person and everything and I just you know, wanted him to know that. And I know that he knows it, but I don't think he truly believes it himself. 
and he's just really kind-hearted. Everybody that meets him, they absolutely adore him and everything, and um, he basically is my rock and everything, and I I love him. <laughs> it sounds like you guys have been through a lot together, and uh, it, it sounds like you're you're just so lucky to have him and lucky to have each other. And we're going to get Chad on the phone and we're going to uh, give him a pretty cool Christmas surprise here. Thanks to our okay. friends at Profenium, okay? Okay. Do you want me to call him? Yes, please. If, okay. you, if you can, go ahead and patch him. him in, please. Yeah, hold on one moment. Okay. He answered. Is, our, is Chad, are you there? Yes, I am. Hi, Chad. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Do you know who... Do, have you been filled in on who you're talking to? Uh, no, I was okay. just texting to answer the phone. Okay, perfect. <laughs> this is George and Jess from Country 103.5, and we are joined by Taylor Grace from Profinium. And uh, Profinium is doing a really cool program this holiday season called Achieving Dreams Together. And uh, your wife, Rosalie, has nominated you for something very, very special. Uh, Rosalie, why don't you tell Chad... Um, what you told us and, and, and tell him uh, what you've nominated him for. Um, I know that the past few years have been really tough, you know, for us and you alone with um, my diagnosis of lupus and then pretty much at the end stages of lupus and now with the cancer scare and everything like that, I just wanted to, to, you know, tell somebody how great you are and that, you know, you've done a lot for me and I don't think I could ever repay what you have done, you know, for me in our marriage and everything with me being so sick. So I reached out to Achieving the Dream and, you know, asked them, you know, basically I told them, you know, a little bit about you and everything that, that you always take care of me first and, you know, since our washer and dryer has broke down, you've been doing, you know, our laundry in the bathtub, you know, just so, you know, I would have clean clothes and you have clean clothes, but mainly, you know, with you trying with what I have, which is an autoimmune disease, I need clean clothes and you do your best. So I reached out and, um, Tara Grace answered and everything, so you'll be well, you'll be getting the washer and dryer. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, will that will that make your life a little bit easier? Uh, yeah, it will. I mean, she's right. I have to, have to do it at the bathtub sometimes, or I, go laundry mat. Right. You know, I can't even imagine that. And if this helps you out a little bit, right? Uh, oh, definitely. Well, we're happy definitely. to have our friends from Profinium here to help you guys out. And uh, I, I'm sure they're going to work all the details on, yeah, on, I, on getting it all set and I uh, the plumbing and everything, right? Yep. So we have DeGroote is going to be so excellent, and they're going to come, and they're going to help install the washer and the dryer upstairs, not in the basement anymore. And they're going to wow. take away the old ones. Yep. And then if... For some reason, we need a plumber. We have Caduce on standby, and they're going to help us get everything set up if need be. And they have been so fabulous. Big shout out to DeGroods and Caduce. Definitely, wow. So I'm excited. Wash and dryer. <laughs> <laughs> well, we wish you guys the best. Thanks for spending a few minutes with us this morning, um, and we just hope that this uh, helps make your life a little bit easier. And again, thank you to our partners, and uh, we wish you guys a merry Christmas. Thank you, you too. Thank you so much, Taylor Grace. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. All right, Rosalie, thank you guys for letting us be part of this as well. We we really enjoy it. Again, Profidium uh, doing all the work on this. We're just lucky enough to be the ones to give you a phone call, and, and it's what the holidays is all about. So uh, best wishes. You know what? And I hope this does help you out a ton. I'm sure it will. Yes, it will. Thank you so much. You're you welcome. Have a good day. Yeah, take care, you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, bye.